Drivetrains allow your robot to drive and turn precise distances with only a single block. You can add a drivetrain to your project with the Devices window. Open the Devices window and select Add a Device. Next, select Drivetrain. First, select the ports for the left and write motors of your drivetrain. Next, select the port for your gyro sensor. Now, let's configure the drivetrain. First, look at the wheels on your drivetrain and select the wheel size from the dropdown. Next, take a look at the gears in the drivetrain and enter the input and output gear ratio. If your drivetrain does not have a gyro, deselect the gyro checkbox. If you do not have a gyro sensor, you will see another setting for the track width, which is the width of the drivetrain. Measure the width of your drivetrain and update this setting. Lastly, if your drivetrain drives in reverse when programmed to drive forward, change the direction arrow to reverse your drivetrain. Select the Done button and the drivetrain blocks will now appear in the toolbox. Your drivetrain is now configured and ready to use.